What's up guys, Ace the Hark here back again with another Bill Burr reaction. Yes, yes. So guys, uh, I want to say uh, thank you for the uh, support on the previous uh, Bill Burr reactions. You guys are awesome, I have to say for sure. So guys, I'm uh, looking to do a lot of Bill Burr for sure as much as I can. Uh, so yes, so today we're going to be looking at Titanic is a horror film. Of course, uh... Sounds pretty interesting. <laughs> Coming from Bilber, of course, it's gonna be quality for sure. So, you guys, uh, yeah, let's not waste too much time and let's get into this. Oh, yeah, let's get that out of the way. You know, 36, <laughs> not married, I sleep on a futon. You know, my back hurts. It's awful. I'm at that age where everybody I know is getting married. People, let me ask you a question. Why the hell do people keep getting married? You know what I mean? Isn't anybody looking at the stats? Yeah. What's it like, three out of four marriages go right down the drain now? That's true. People, if you were going skydiving and they told you three out of four parachutes weren't going to open... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Forget it, I'm not going. Yeah. I don't like those odds. Yeah, it's, it's really bad. I'm just kidding, people. You know what? I'll get married. I'll get married the day I see a married guy who actually, like, looks happy. You know what I mean? Because every time you see what? a married dude, anytime you ask him what it's like being married, they always tell you it's good, but they have a look on their face like they have, like, an appendicitis. <laughs> oh, it's hilarious. You're like, yeah, you know, so what's it like being married? They're like, you know, it's good. It's good. That's <laughs> no, good. You know, it's a lot of work, but, uh, you know, it's good. You know, when you meet, when you meet the right person. And, you know, yeah, yeah. Clean, you know, it's definitely it's a good thing. I, you know, I enjoy it. You meet that person, you know when you know, I can't feel my legs. No, you know when you know. It's he, definitely, it's a good thing. Just That's true, that's honestly true. I'm gonna pause right here, folks. Uh, to what Bill Burr said here, yeah, the, uh, as we all know, you know, the stats on, you know, marriages of, man, even in today, 2022, guys, it's gone down for sure. And, uh, <laughs> Bill Burr just has a knack for just making everything a damn joke. And of course, he's amazing at it. That's one thing, thing for sure. You know, let's get back into this. It's a good thing. Just to... I love women, though. This is my deal. I love women, but you know what I'm finding? I'm not compatible with them. You know? Really? I'm serious. Women have, like, too much energy for me. That's what I've noticed, you know? Like, really? you can't have a day off when you have a girlfriend. They just like see that open day, they're like, oh my god, let's go fill it up with some stuff. <laughs> no, and then they just come at you with one horrible idea after another. Horrible ideas, like, you want to make some sandwiches to go to the park? <laughs> the way he does it. No, every one of their ideas involves like walking around, like looking at stuff. It's almost like they're trying to wear you down. <laughs> After like two or three stores, you're like leaning on stuff. Oh, I don't care. <laughs> Just buy something. I don't care. <laughs> you know what the worst one is? You ever get that one? You want to go to brunch? Yeah. <laughs> you want to go to brunch on Sunday? And inside you're like, no! <laughs> but you can't say that. You got to keep them happy, right? Yeah, yeah. So what do you do? You're like, yeah, let's go to brunch. What a great idea. Why would you want to sleep in on a Sunday when you can go pay $18 for eggs? Now nah, you're thinking. <laughs> now nah, you're thinking. Then we can sit around and listen to your friends have moronic conversations about the eggs. Moronic. Like, is that pesto? <laughs> is that pesto in your omelet? Oh, it's asparagus. It's asparagus. It's <laughs> pesto. Why did that... That's possible over time, guys. Guys, um, yeah, for Bilber here, you know, he just, he's just so damn good at just, you know, the acting part. Like, if you're someone who doesn't even, like, know Bilber and you just happen to be in the crowd here, like, hey, you know, let, let's let's go to the um, stand-up. Let's go. Let's see what this guy has. And then, you know, right off the bat, this guy does all this. You know, you, it has to crack you up. Some, something, it just has to happen. You have to laugh to me. So, I was dating this girl recently. This girl's like really like into like women's issues. <laughs> <laughs> she 
She got me this book on women's lib one time, right? So I'm reading this thing. I think women's lib was a great thing. Like back in the 70s, I thought it was cool, you know? Mm -hmm. Over the last couple of years, though, I think that whole woman's movement, it's really starting to morph into kind of like this reverse pimping kind of thing, you know? Because every time you see them on TV, they always say, all we want is to be treated exactly like guys, right? Mm -hmm. But if you listen to them, they don't. They only want the good stuff of being a guy. They look at a guy's life like it's like a buffet. Yeah. <laughs> like you just can start picking out stuff, like same amount an hour, we'll take some of that. Pay for the movie, that's okay, you can keep that one, I don't like that one. <laughs> this is nice, that's yucky, that's icky. <laughs> I mean, come on people, you can't choose. This girl gave me a rough time one time, she goes, well why does a guy make more an hour to do the exact same job? I go, I'll tell you why. Because in the unlikely event that we're both on a Titanic and it starts to sink, <laughs> for some screwed up reason, you get to leave with the kids and I have to stay. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's why I get the dollar more an hour. <laughs> you know, if there's a house fire, it's always women and children first. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta stand there with like the back of my shirt on fire. Going, let's go, people! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Yeah. <laughs> so that's how I look at it. No, it's a dollar an hour surcharge. Seriously, that if something screwed up happens, either I can't leave or I gotta like get in the way of it to give you a head start, like rabbit dog, run honey, one Mississippi, two Mississippi. <laughs> you hear a bump in the night, I gotta go check it out, like yes, he does have a knife. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't think a woman should make a doll less than an hour to do the exact same job, okay? I'm not saying that. All I'm saying is if you're gonna make what I make when the boat sinks, you better be standing right there next to me, listening to that guy yeah. play the cello. <laughs> <laughs> I don't got a problem. You got all the benefits. That's why I didn't like that movie, The Titanic. You know, you know what I hate about that movie? Every girl like me thinks that movie's romantic. Like, oh my god, yeah. that was so romantic. Yeah, I yeah. Think. No! <laughs> no, I don't. It was a horror film. Well... And they're always like, why? Why? Because all the guys die. <laughs> See, you're sitting there watching it going, who would I be in that scenario? You'd be that chick floating away in the big piece of luggage. <laughs> I'm watching it going, who would I be? I'd be that dude when, like, the boat breaks in half, that dude who, like, falls straight down, bangs off the stuff and goes into the water. <laughs> That's who I'd be. I'd be wearing a tuxedo, not because I wanted to, but you wanted to dress up that night, right? <laughs> and I'd just be falling the whole way down. I should have humped that chicken for his <laughs> All right, I'm out of time. You guys have a lot of fun. Thank you very much. No! Howie Mandel here. Wow, wow. Guys, another Bill Burr video. What can I say? This guy is amazing amazing guys guys i really hope you uh, enjoyed this uh video here as much as i did for sure uh like i said the titanic um you know the part when he said a horror uh it's a horror film what i got from that is like you know back in, you know watching that movies when you know you're in that scene and you know that boat is sinking like yo you know but he said something <laughs> But yes, guys, I want to thank you so much for, uh, you know, supporting again. Thank you for taking a look at, at this reaction here. It means a lot to me. I'll be going out to do a lot more reactions, so stay tuned for that as well. All right, guys, wherever you are, uh, I hope you're doing well. I hope you're safe, and I love you guys. Guys, take care, okay?